Howdy guys, welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. This is Nintendo Capri Sun, and there are still six hidden skills for you to learn. In the last episode, we learned the first of the six hidden skills, which is the finishing blow. Which is just a cool way to finish off enemies that are stunned, and uh, before they have a chance to get up, you can actually sometimes use the finishing blow to finish them off prematurely. It's kind of, it's like a cheap shot, basically. You hit them while they're down, and finish them right away. You can even do it on some bosses, which is totally cool. Back in the Farron Woods again. Boy, that was a strange little acid trip we went on there. Hey, wait, I see a treasure over here. How about that? What do we got? It's a yellow rupee! Cool! Alright. So we're almost... what? Oh, seeds. Okay, yeah, slingshot seeds. I almost forgot about that. Jeez, I forgot all about the slingshot. Good lord. Okay, I'm just mowing... well, we're gonna get rupees in the temple anyway, so it doesn't matter. But the thing is, you're going to need a lot of rupees later, like 200 for something else. And that's not too far from now, so... You know. Anyway, let's see if we can show off the finishing blow here. Oops. Well, I had a chance, but I think I killed him too fast. Oh, you got a blue rupee. Anytime you save the game, and then you come back... ...to start a new... or to start over, well... Oh, these guys keep dying before I get a chance to do anything. Okay, so, uh, oops. Go to the right subscreen now. So, if you have your lantern and bottle equipped it, and then you use the bottle, it'll use the bottle to fill the lantern, which is kind of cool. It's cool how they have things where you can use two items at once like that. Dude, don't do that! Oh my god, we're going to have to get used to that. I'm going to put the slingshot on Y, and uh, this game doesn't have a Z slot, so that's kind of unfortunate, but I mean, the Z is basically Midna's slot. She kind of hogs it, so... Can't equip an item there, but I never did that anyway in Wind Waker. You saw me going around the entire dungeons with my sail set to Z. I'm not a big fan of the Z button, to be honest. It's just too small or something. Anyway, we don't need that anymore, so... We'll turn it off. We need to conserve our oil here. Because <laughs> we may be needing it. Fortunately, this place is pretty well lit, so you don't have to worry about too much of anything here. So, put it away. Oh, hello! Yeah, so this is the Forest Temple, y'all. First temple of the game. Gotta love it. It's kind of unfortunate that you don't get to do a temple first. Like, you don't really get any kind of boss fight before the first time you have to do that stuff with the Tears of Light. And I think that kind of turns people off of the game early, because they don't get a chance to... Wait. <laughs> Man, you didn't even get it all? Holy crap. Try it again. There we go. Yeah, because you get sent off to do this thing with the Tears of Light, and it's like, okay, when are we going to get to fight a boss here, you know? And it's like, we're already 12 videos into this, and we haven't seen a boss yet. That's the monkey that stole your lantern. Doesn't it look like she's beckoning you? Aren't you the popular one? Hehehe. <laughs> yeah, I know. I am. I'm so popular. It just makes me sick how popular I am. So she's beckoning me. Well, let's see what she wants. So this temple is kind of, I don't know, for a first temple, I actually think it's pretty complicated. You got these monkeys that'll be following you around throughout the temple, and you have to, you'll have to actually use them to get around in the temple, because you'll be swinging by their arms. Can't do much there. Well, I can't wait, can we? We may be able to. So set her down, see what we got. Bam! Nice. Yeah, that sound was fast. Oh, you got a red rupee. Nice. But Link's uh, mouth is still not open. So, <laughs> I think he only opens it when it gets to an orange rupee, which is worth a hundred. Holy mackerel, look at this guy. <laughs> oh, man, perfect chance to use the Marv Club. Wait, I'm not hitting him there. This guy's kind of complicated. Like, you want to... Ugh. Like, I don't... I don't... Okay, that's how you beat him. You just go to troll yeah. Anyway, light the torches. As if that couldn't be any more obvious. And the stairs come up blocking off that treasure chest. So if you want to get the treasure chest, make sure you do that first. Before you do this. So the monkey basically tells you where to go, but let's not forget to do this here. Okay, what do we got? Oh, I can't wait to see. I'm so excited. First hand rubbing of the LP. You got the map! The yellow arrow shows your current location. Cool. Let's move on. Okay, looks like we're outside now. 
and there's bridges, and they're turning 90 degrees with the wind, and there's a really rickety bridge there that doesn't look very trustworthy. Dude, what are you doing? You're not gonna make that. Whoa! Ah! Uh, turn around! No! Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh man! Who is this guy? <laughs> I love how he slaps his ass. I love the way you slap your ass! Just whatever. <laughs> well, that bridge, we're gonna have to find another way to cross, I guess. Oh, what's going on? Has there been a monkey fight? Oh, no. We can't go any further. We might as well go back. I don't know what's going on, but it seems like she wants to take you somewhere. Yep, so this is where the monkeys come into play. Basically, you open the door, they follow you through. You don't have to wait for them. You don't have to carry them through the doors or any of that garbage. Could you imagine if you had to do that? Just, oh, man. Anyway, you try going to the side here, and she'll actually jump up on the rope and give you a way to swing across. You just have to time it right. Always check, like, the sides here. Like, you see there's vines here. I'm not sure where these go. Probably nowhere, but... I'm gonna take a look anyway. No, they don't go anywhere. Okay, well, let's head through the door. Well, they probably do go somewhere, like, later. I don't know. Anyway, this cave here's got a dead end over here and a bomb flower. These bomb flowers are really strange in this game. Okay. Put the lantern away. <laughs> I can already see my oils. Running out. Is this the room that I think it is? Because I there is one room in this place that I just can't stand. And I always get lost in it for some reason. Like, always. It's ridiculous, man. Okay, where do you want to go? Oh, you're scared. Why are you scared? What's... There's something... Oh, there's a spider. Huh. Okay, I guess you're okay now. Cool. Yeah, you gotta watch that when the monkey gets scared. Oh, hello. We have a locked door. But we didn't pick up a key anywhere. Holy crap, did I forget the key? Are you freaking kidding me? I missed the first key in the first dungeon? Oh. Well, maybe she wants you to go that way and you're not supposed to. Let's check what's out here. Again. I'm pretty sure the first key is like in a treasure chest right to the side of a door somewhere. Oh, we can't exactly do much there. Let's just go across here and kind of take a look around. I sincerely hope that I didn't miss the first key already. That would just be embarrassing. Sometimes I just don't stop and take a look. Let's see what we got here. The big treasure chest looks promising. There's a key! Alright! Now this room we'll be coming back to later. You can't do much with this now because the bridge isn't aligned with our current pathway, so... Oh, crap. Uh, I'm gonna turn off my screensaver over there. I can't see what time I'm at. Okay, now. <clears throat> so sorry about that. Oh, jeez. Okay, so we're heading back to the uh, locked door that we just saw earlier that the monkey wanted us to go through, but we couldn't. So we didn't have a key. I guess the monkey thinks we have some kind of magic power as well. Now I do, sort of, so... Yeah, jump around with me. Let's have some fun. I love how the locked doors unlock. Just how the chains come undone, it's so sexual or something. And it is, I mean, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, so, what's this? It's just, it's so realistic, it's almost disarming. <laughs> like you're gonna do anything, then they're pulling it. You're just like in that Foo Fighters video where they're trying to push through the door. Oh, what is that? What video is that? It's Monkey Wrench, I think. The bridge just fell behind us, so we don't have a way out of here now, all of a sudden. But there's a monkey trapped here. Maybe between the two of these monkeys we can get some help here. Uh, that didn't seem to work. Let's try it again. Still didn't work. One more time. Boom! There we go. The monkey's free. First thing he does is touch his ass, too. Her ass. Something. Oh, no. Don't scare the monkeys. I was just starting to tame them. Wait, were you actually going to attack the monkey? Seriously? Were you about to do that? Now, uh, I don't have a compass, but I'm pretty sure there's a treasure in here. It's off on the... yeah, it's right there. Huh. These all mostly have rupees in them, so you don't have to pick them up, but it's not a bad idea. Just so you can have them for later, so you don't have to grind and shit. Anyway, so head back up the stairs to this bridge that broke out behind us earlier. But now that we have two monkeys freed, we'll be able to get across it, so... 
Just like that. And this is pretty much how we're going to be getting around the temple, so... Just keep that in mind. The monkeys will follow you pretty much anywhere that they can go. Which is pretty much everywhere. So you don't have to worry too much about that. But the more monkeys you unlock, the more access you have to different areas of the temple. So that's what we're going to be doing, and that's how it's going to work. But I'm pretty much out of time here, so... Oh, much as I hate it. Let's take a look and see what's over there. That's for lighter. Mm, that's something else over there. Whatever. Okay, so next time on Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, we will continue in the temple, and I will leave you with this lovely shot of monkey butt. <laughs> see you later, guys.